Just in time for Thanksgiving, a local teenager is home tonight after spending 98 long days in three hospitals. He was critically hurt in a terrible accident last August. But he has been working hard to regain his strength, and this day represents a victory. 13-year-old Javen Fox from Athol walked out of Franciscan Children's Hospital today without any help. That's something his family couldn't imagine three months ago. <laughs> That's when Javen suffered a brain injury in a crash with a pickup truck while he was riding his bike. He couldn't walk, he couldn't talk, he couldn't eat. The intense therapy at the hospital was necessary but grueling. Hours every day. Speech, physical, and occupational therapy. They kept on asking me to do stuff, so I just kept on doing it so I could get out of here sooner. And that's exactly what happened. He had to relearn to walk. He had to relearn how to communicate. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. And this is going to be the best Thanksgiving ever. To have him home for the holidays is truly a blessing. I'm just looking forward to seeing my family. Leaving Franciscan Hospital is bittersweet for both Javen and his therapist. He always talks about how important his family and his friends are, so he's ready for that sense of home again. All of the nurses have been so kind, and his care team is phenomenal. And soon, this hockey player, volleyball player, saxophone playing Boy Scout will be back to school and back with his friends, back home a lot to be thankful for. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Happy to see that, and that strength runs in the family. Javen's mother says what happened to her son was just a terrible accident that no one's to blame, and the driver is actually a family friend who's visited Javen and held fundraisers for him. Wow. That's incredible.